are so many people in the U.S. today overweight? Why are a larger percentage of Americans diabetic than ever before in human history? And why are more and more people falling victim to diseases you thought you'd never see until you reached your grandfather's age? Official agencies tell us that it's our fault. Too many sugary snacks, too many supersized sodas, too much TV, and too little exercise. Hi, I'm Dr. William Davis, and I disagree. In fact, I'm going to propose to you that it is the national message to eat more healthy whole grains that got us into this mess. And I'm going to propose that walking away from that advice provides not only the solution to substantial weight loss, but also leads to the solutions for numerous abnormal health conditions. In his controversial new book, Wheat Belly, cardiologist Dr. William Davis makes the case that the wheat you are being sold today in supermarkets, bakeries, and restaurants across the U.S. is not the same as the wheat of our parents' day. Wheat has been changed, changed in surprising ways by geneticists and agribusiness. The result, Davis says, is that modern wheat now stimulates appetite, making us want to eat more, triggers blood sugar and insulin more than table sugar or candy bars, and leads to cataracts, arthritis, heart disease, inflammation, along with a host of other conditions. What finally convinced me that there was a huge problem here was what I witnessed when I asked people to remove all wheat products from their diet. That's when I saw complete turnarounds in health and weight, and that's why I wrote Wheat Belly. In addition to making the case against modern wheat as nutrition public enemy number one, Dr. Davis leads you on your journey back to normal weight and health and shows you how to reconstruct your life after saying goodbye to wheat. Wheat Belly. Lose the wheat, lose the weight, and find your path back to health. A new book published by Rodale and sold in all major bookstores nationwide.